It's 2015, mm -hmm. you guys, and times are changing. According to Match.com, 87% of men would date a woman who's better educated, who makes more money, and is more intellectual than they are. Wow. I think that's really cool. I think that's yeah. great. I, I think love that's that. Smart. So why do you guys think all of a sudden there is this, this change? I guess I've always thought we women, I don't know about you guys, but me, I've always dated like that. I've always like what you mean? To You've date, always dated, dated up. up. Yeah, right. I don't want exactly who I am, and uh, I don't want exact. I, I want to learn from my man. I but I think it's going to be harder because I don't think women, like you said, date down. So yeah, because she said men. Right. Because I'm talking right. about men. Yes. These right. are men, you know, that say they they are dating. They're dating up. You don't mind dating, a, you know, a man, yes. who, you know, who makes more, teach you more money than you. But a man has this ego about them. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that guys yes. came down. I what? I don't know, guys. No, I, I when you're okay, saying... Okay, look I, at the example, okay? okay? Not to talk about these women, yeah. but I'm saying just the thought of it, like George Clooney. Mm -hmm. For a long time, he was dating, like, waitresses and wrestlers, mm -hmm. you know, compared to him being saving... Haiti and being this great actor. Is that for dating him to down date. though, or was he just dating somebody who I felt like he's not a regular actor. woman? Stay with it. I'm Jean. saying in general for a very long time. Stay with it. And you date somebody that work at Denny's. You, I mean, come on, that. Come on, Jean. what I'm saying is me. okay. Not so much about their occupation, but for a really yes. long time, wouldn't you guys say that men who were extremely successful sometimes would date? you know, very beautiful woman that didn't have much up here. Which for a long time was considered the trophy wife. Do you guys yes. remember that? Yes. Right. And now the trophy wife has to have some trophies of her own. Absolutely. And I love that. I and like I that love too. it. Yeah. But, I mean, you try not to talk about women, but you are talking now. about women, whether they have something up here or whether they're occupation. A lot of women have something. Type. Yes, yeah, occupation but, right. doesn't always equate what they're exactly. telling. But this, with but this study, it included everything. Yeah. Finances, uh, you know, intellectual. Sam, times are completely yes. different. Yes, now. no, you know I love it's it. So not the 1950s where, you know, women are becoming bosses, hello, right. you know what I'm saying? Exactly. And, you know, we have actually have a brain and, you know, can use them and want to use yeah. them and don't want, you know, anybody to hold us back. I think that's why most of us wait until we get married in our, you know, 30s and stuff like yeah. that, have babies in our 30s and stuff like that because we want to establish who we are because yes. it has a lot to do with, you know, the kind of parent, the kind of wife you're going to be. I and these men agree. are getting lonely. That's what I think. Yeah. Okay? I know what? They get lonely and they see in these women, they got they self together, they got they look, they know what they're talking about and then they, they just getting lonely because yeah. they're like, oh, I, let me find a woman that I can control. See, a lot of it That's has true. to control. Yeah. Yeah. You can't control a lot of a smart and intellectual women. You really can't control them exactly. as much and not men are getting is, lonely. Exactly. Is there a chance though that that study reflects men dating more up because now there are more women available who have come up? Yes, Absolutely. yes. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay I, I, now for, for us women to choose a career first right? before we, you know, take a relationship, you know, seriously. I know for my I'm husband, saying. he thinks it's sexy. I mean, there are times that, you know, he makes more money than I do, mm -hmm. but when I make more, more money than, than he does, he's like, yes! I got a sugar mama. Are you going to take me out? Yeah. Yeah. I love it. It's he loves it. Yeah. He loves it. It's a turn on for him. You guys yeah. actually know a guy in your life that dates down or dated down before. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Yeah. All of oh, them. A bunch, a bunch of guys. All I, my cousins take down. Yeah, I used to know guys that mean? specifically wanted a woman to be seen and not, not her. heard. Period. Mm -hmm. right. I actually wow. knew a guy that would say, um, the sexiest thing I find about her is that she knows when to shut up. Yeah. That's I actually crazy. have oh, heard yeah. a man Ooh. say that. Yeah, wow. that she never questioned him. He was in control of money. Fin mm -hmm. He was in control of the relationship. She kind of didn't have a life of her own. Mm -hmm. Right. And when he'd invite her out, she always looked stunning. She was a naturally super beautiful girl. Mm -hmm. But, um not very confident mm -hmm. and was beautiful but just kind of was riding on his coattails mm -hmm. and I think she was okay with that and more than that he loved it and so yeah. that's just a lack of confidence mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. That it doesn't have self-esteem mm -hmm. that he could try to control exactly and you know today's women we, we just change and I just feel like that's, 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 that's that. like cockamamian bull, bull, a bull crap story <laughs> yeah. because you know I don't feel like they really want somebody who's gonna take charge and you know uh, control them and I don't feel like they want to be controlled Right. I feel like they like it when we give them a challenge. You know what I'm oh, saying? Yeah. A strong like, man likes a strong to? woman. They like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm.